Hi, my name is Mark Sekula, and I'm going to take you through a review of uh, one of the adapters that is available, in this case a Nikon uh, adapter, for an older Nikon lens, which is here on the right-hand side. Uh, and this adapter is an E-mount adapter for the uh, A6000, Sony A6000 camera. And this allows you to take this older lens and use it on this A6000 camera. And how it does that is, again, through this E-mount lens uh, or converter or adapter that goes on it. So let me show you how this works. This adapter has a, a little red dot on it that connects with uh, a dot that's on the uh, lens. In this case, this lens is so old, I don't think it even has a dot on it. So um, you've got to kind of, uh, in this case, kind of figure out where it would connect um, and then snap it on, which I just did. Once you have it on the, the lens, the, the adapter on the lens, then you need to connect it onto the camera itself. And again, there's a, a red dot, as you can see here, and a white dot on the uh, Sony A6000. What you do is you take the camera, you, you link up the dots, you turn the lens like you would normally uh, on any lens that you're going to uh, connect onto the camera and you've got it done. It's, it's connected onto the camera. At this point, you're ready to take shots. Now, because uh, the camera is uh, connected using this adapter, you cannot use the autofocus feature of the camera. So therefore, everything you take with this lens uh, and this adapter connected will be manual focus. So how do you do that when you have a lens that's this old how do you focus on a subject? Well, you, first of all, you get to look through the uh, the adapter, or excuse me, the uh, the viewfinder. I'm going to be looking through the uh, the screen here, but you would look through the viewfinder until you feel that you have a good shot, and then you take the shot. So in this case, I'm going to use the viewfinder and kind of zoom in on the on the uh, photo. And in this case, I'm going to take my best shot as to what the photo the best focus that I have with this lens and that's about right I think about there so I'm going to take my shot so I took a shot now was that a good shot I don't know I mean once I uh, look at the picture I'll be able to tell if it's a good shot um, one of the things that Sony provides is a uh, is an ability to magnify the picture that you're about to take a photo of therefore allowing you to better focus on that uh, object, therefore hopefully giving you a better shot. So what I'm going to do now is um, I, I set up this button here on the, on the top here to be the, uh, the auto uh, or the focus magnifier. So when I click on that, you see a little square come up on the screen. What that allows me to do is to then uh, hit the button again here uh, up on the top of this camera and I customize this so I can use this button and I'm going to show you how to do this uh, after uh, I'm done this but you basically hit it once and it zooms in on the picture and if I don't know if you noticed but now I'm seeing a, a larger photo of the or a larger picture of the actual uh, statue I'm trying to take a picture of now I can better focus on it I can use the uh, focus wheel on the uh, lens and hopefully get a better picture than I had before and there I go I'm, I'm zooming a little better and it looks like a better shot to me so now if I take a shot I'm hoping that's going to be a better shot than the last one so let's take a look at what I took a picture of now let's look at the first one here's the first one I took a picture of let me zoom in on it it looks kind of blurry it does look kind of blurry uh, I don't know if you can see that through this video, but it does look blurry. Let me take a look at, let's take a look at the second picture that was taken when I focused in better using the feature of the camera to magnify it. And if I hit this button and zoom in, uh, I don't know if you can tell, but that's a lot better focused picture. And the reason is that I magnified it, then I took the picture. So how do you set this up in the camera? How do you set it up so that this, this button I used up here 
is that button uh, that will magnify. So as you can see, it says C1 on here. It's custom button one. How do you do that? So you go to your menu, and you go to, uh, you're under your, uh, what looks like a, uh, it's your settings, basically. It's the, looks like a cogwheel here. And you go to number six, in my case, uh, and it says custom key settings. I click on that. And then it says custom button one, which is the button that I was using. In this case, you can see it's already set to custom magnifier. But what if it wasn't? Then you'd have to pick from all this list of different features that that button can do. In this case, we want to go to the focus magnifier. We go down to it. And then we find this center button here on the camera. We click on it, and it sets it to that, to that setting. Now we're ready to go and we're ready to use the custom setting button. And that's it. That's how you uh, basically connect your, uh, your, your older lens to a Sony, in this case, A6000, using this adapter, and also uh, how to uh, basically focus it in better using the focus magnifier. The last thing I want to just show you is you can also, uh, you also want to take off the lens after you're done, right? And that could be a problem. So let me take it off the camera. You hit this button below here like you normally would to take the lens off. But how do you take the lens off of the uh, actual adapter? There's a button right here. You push it away from the lens towards, your, towards, this, towards that direction towards that direction, you push in and you twist just like you did to put it on and when you do that it comes off but you have to use this button right here which is basically a lock it goes in when you push it in uh, and you use that for that purpose and that's pretty much how you both put on the adapter onto your older lens and also connect it to the the camera, in this case the A6000. It's a great way to use your older lens that you have for your Nikon or your Canon uh, or Pentax or other lenses you have sitting around that you want to use. The one thing I will say is that uh, there are adapters, there's one adapter that actually worked with the Canon that actually allows you to autofocus using the autofocus mechanism of the in this case A6000. Nice feature to have not all these adapters have that, so most of them you have to uh, manually focus, which is fine, and it's not hard to do, but it is a little bit more of a, a challenge, uh, given that you know each of the lens that you will use will have uh, a different way of focusing it, uh, you know, to get a good shot. So pretty much that's what I wanted to let you know, and I hope this was helpful to you. And if it was, let me know. Thank you so much.